Today we've got a treat for you, some of the most entertaining Karens caught on camera throwing public meltdowns. Strap on. Woman confronts a Starbucks employee for making a copy of her credit card and spends $200 what are you from doing? it. So we got you on camera yesterday at Ralph's for $212. So just know that the cops are coming up here. They recorded your everything. You took a copy of my the other day on New Year's Day. You know what you did. Right? You know what you did, right? I'm so sorry, man. You're sorry about what? That you went to Ralph's? You took a copy of my card here while you said you were going to go get receipt paper. And they got you on camera yesterday. So, uh, do you know what you did, right? Before I file charges and everything I'm on you. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So, what are you sorry about? That you took money from me and my kids? What are you sorry about? I'm sorry that I took money from you and your kids. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that you had to come up here. I'm sorry that this is inconvenient for you. I'm sorry. You're sorry that you're about to lose your job because corporate knows? Is that what you're sorry about, too? I'm so sorry. All right, let's go. I'm so sorry. I am a good child. I swear. I'm really you're a good, good. child. Uh -huh. I really do go to mm -hmm. school. I'm 19. I play soccer. So, why the how would you even make a copy of my card? I knew you took a minute. You went back there for a minute and I knew what I the hell copy, you were doing. I didn't copy it. You I took, took a picture or I don't know what you did. I but you obviously numbers. thought I wasn't going to come back here and we uh, you thought I wasn't even going to get to the bottom of it. I'm so sorry. Please press charges. I I, I am seriously going to press charges. I I'm good. Right now. No, I, so I honestly, the I the, I'm getting the money from the bank anyway. I'm getting swear, the money from the bank. I swear on my life, I you didn't, didn't get what the it went through the 212. You, you come to Starbucks to get coffee, not to get robbed. I swear, I swear on my life that lightning will strike me down right now. I swear. this disrespectful woman makes a scene at a store and yells at a worker non stop. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. to yourself sometimes. Yeah. I was nice about it when I came in and asked for it. I don't want your help. I don't want your help. Get your supervisor. Get your manager. I don't want the manager. I say supervisor. Take care of the customer. I don't want your help. Do you understand? Yes, I do. You won't shut up. But you don't have any of this. You don't have Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. No, she don't. No. It's completely uncomfortable. Because you're harassing me. Leave me alone. Do you not understand? Call your boss. Call your boss right now. Call your boss. You're not the one I want to talk to. Call your boss. Whose number is this? That's the corporate number. You wanted the corporate number. Yes. You want to write it down? Yeah, that is the number. Write corporate number on there for that me. That is the corporate number. Write the word corporate office for me. Yeah, that's the corporate number for me. Write it down. Okay. I'll pay for my food if you walk away. Ma'am, I'm not going to walk away because my 14 year transaction is not going through. Because uh, you've been talking to me. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Ma'am. Okay, I'll let you be sure. Leave me alone, sir. Ma'am, she would listen to this. And still, the team just did, you wouldn't have any problem. Ma'am, I just asked where you're from. That's all I asked. Karen accuses a man of stealing her phone, then finds out it was in her bag the whole time. Well, he could have turned off the ring, the ringer. Oh, oh my wait, God! What I are you doing? Like All right, guys. I can't like your phone. You don't. You don't need guys, to. Guys, yeah, dude. Let's try Stay to. Calm and let's try to just stay calm and cool. Okay. So now it's. I really need my phone back. Stop looking okay. at him like it's hurt. Talk to him. He's trying to help you. Let me get the number. Now it's. Is everything in my pocket? Do you want to pat him down? You can pat him down, girl. It's in his pocket. 
it won't ring because he turned off your ringer. Is what yeah. you're also accusing us of. Even though he just emptied out everything in his pocket. Want to, do you want to turn around? Guys, can we? She can't. Well, they have my number, then they and they have my phone. Well, let's. You we don't have your phone. It was. I just stuck it right here. You walk right behind right, me. How about you type it? In. I didn't take. You type it in. I did not take. <laughs> what would I even do? Right is it in your purse, man? Yeah, it is. I'm so oh, sorry. Man. Really? <laughs> I am sorry. All right, I cool. Sorry. I apologize. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> Loud man at Duncan Drive Thru claims he can't hear the employee but ends up screaming at a man behind him. I don't know what your problem is, buddy. Come on, let's go. I don't know what your problem is. You're holding us all up. Where the hell are you going? You ain't going nowhere anywhere. I ain't holding nobody up. These dog owners are mad at the groomer for messing up their dog's coat. You should have cooked it in the back one. You should have done it in the first place. What? You shouldn't have done it in the first place. Yeah, you should have. Yeah, you know what? what? That's why we're not going to do these anymore. Because you know what? Oh, I told you shouldn't be doing any damn face. dog ever you again. I you told you. Four or five, and you said his back was I fine. I told you. You said he'd be the white of a golden retriever. You know that's a four or a five. What you used that? It was a five. No, it wasn't. It's his hair. His hair is shorter than the last. Because of the tension. Okay, when the matted, it pulls it up like this, and it makes it shorter. Okay, that's the only reason he's short. No. We used to buy There's a guard on that. There can't be a guard on it. He's too matted to be on a guard. What are you guys? You can't do that, dude. You have a short dog. They usually always. You guys take care of your dog, and we will too. Oh, we do. You clearly don't. We've had dogs for forty years. We have never had an issue until you. I have a thousand. But if you want to take me to court, no. This is what we got to do. Can you listen to him? You deal say, with him. You said there were no mats on his back. You said there was I said that mats. his chest and his back and his, you said back, his back is fine. You said so what am I supposed to do? Leave his back and she said, said you were going to blend it. His head looks like it's Photoshop. Hey, Jesse, you want to go play with your dog? Dude freaks out at a Starbucks employee for not honoring his 2006 coupon. Six. Well, I just had a free drink here. There's no expiration date on it. You can see. It says redeemable at, only at participating Starbucks US and Canada. Surrender card at any time. Redemption received. Complimentary drink any size. Not valid with any other offer or discount. Not valid and reproduced. Void where prohibited. Yeah, there's no expiration date on it. So it's good. I don't know what they're talking about. A time ago, but he said that there's no expiration date on it. I'm just cashing it in now. So you have to honor it. It doesn't say expired any, anywhere. I would, I would call customer service. No, no, no. You guys have to honor it. it doesn't, sure, like, I, I don't understand why you guys, why you guys can't, can't honor it. I got it from a Starbucks store, though. I understand. Like, literally, you guys are a billion-dollar company, and you guys won't accept, like, yes. the coupons that you guys give me? Or is that That's ridiculous. Sir, I, I can't take these. I'm so sorry. I would call customer service and have them. Are you, are you No, no, no. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. You know, you do realize that it says it doesn't expire, right? Like on the thing. I'm just asking for like a drink because I got it from your company and it doesn't expire. I would, I would talk to customer service because we, we don't use these anymore. I, so it, I well, that's not my problem. That's not my problem. Yep, I'm just I'm just following the rules, sir. What are you talking about, man? No, no, no. You accept these. Man. You have to. Not, sir. You guys are a billion dollar company. I don't understand why you guys can't accept these two coupons that you gave me. 
don't understand why you can't accept these two coupons. It doesn't say expiration date on it at all. Just punch in the code right here. It doesn't work. The on SKU one one zero two seven one three. SKU doesn't work on systems. I I get you know, this lady right here. I gave you two of these coupons last time and you accepted them and you gave yeah. me two drinks, right? Because at one point they were valid, but I don't understand why you guys are being hypocrites. You know? But that differs the entire system that we use now. Yeah, but that doesn't. That, that's not my fault. That's not my fault that you guys didn't write. That, that the, that's not my fault that you guys didn't write expir, expired on it. I will contact customer service. They can help you out with it. Why would I contact customer service when you guys gave it to me physically? Like that doesn't make any sense. Sir, I can't take that. So you took it last time, but you won't take it now. It doesn't make any sense. Like I don't understand why so you guys do that. The way that she rang it up was the way that for you to do it. So. So bring it up the same thing, the same way. Like you guys gave me the drink last time. No, you guys, seriously, seriously. You guys are like, just take this, bring it up however it was last time, and give me the drinks. You guys, you're serious. These these coupons are not accepted. Are you serious? You're serious. Just give me my drinks, because you guys owe me two drinks for that, though. I don't understand why you guys won't let me do that. I don't know, like, this is, this is, this is does it not say Starbucks on it? It says Starbucks on it, right? You guys, so you guys give me a bad experience when I come into your store and you give me the coupon, right? So I can use it whenever I want. It doesn't matter like how long I hold it for, and you can't accept it. So at this point, we don't have anymore. So it's a different entire system that we use now. Yeah, but that doesn't. That, that's not my fault. That's not my fault that you guys didn't write. That, 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 that's not my fault that you guys didn't write expir, expired on it. Why would I contact customer service when you guys gave it to me physically? Does it not say Starbucks on it? It says Starbucks on it, right? Yeah, I understand. No, no, no read that. Read, no, does it say expired? Does it say ex No, I'm just saying, does it say expired? Does it say expired? I understand. No, 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 answer the question. Answer the question. Does it say expired? No, no, no. Give me my two drinks. Give me my two drinks. Why not? Tell me why. How is it no valid? How is it not valid when there's no expiration date on it? How it doesn't matter how long I had it for. It doesn't have an expiration date, so therefore it is valid. No, no, I'm not contacting customer service. Give me my two drinks. Sir, are you the manager? Yes. These are valid. I don't understand why. You're, why are you being so difficult, man? All right, I'm gonna go use this at another Starbucks, and they're gonna accept it, and I'll video it, and I'll come show you, right? You can't fill the Starbucks. I don't. What are you talking about? I can fill more than I want. I can. I can fill more than I want. This drunk guy throws a tantrum at a flight attendant and weirdly growls at her. We're not on the ground. We're not. We are. We're crowded. Sit. Anyone else get up? Sit. Cameron thinks she owns the neighborhood, so she calls the cops on a family for having a yard sale. I'm going to my city council. That's all right. I already talked to him, and that's why I got my license with the city council. So I already talked. No. And I pay my. No, taxes. no. Get off the corner before we call the police. And I and I pay my taxes. So this I know I ain't doing that wrong. They already came. Get away! Get away from they, here before they were the police. Okay, not come over here. Yeah, get away from here. here. Get away from here. They were I'm already here. The okay, okay, goodbye. Please call. Them. Please do. Don't please go by her car, worry. Stay right here. Stay right here. Now you are harassing us. Yeah. Because I know you have something more that you can do with your day than rather bother some people hey. out here with a yard sale. This is not bothering you at all. It has nothing to do about a business. This has something to do about business. Okay. No, you're right. You're right. Man. Leave them alone! Granny calls the cops at a DoorDash delivery woman for blocking her driveway. Take pictures of me. Tell them you try, what you trying to do to me, though. Hammond, Indiana. 
Linda. Give me your name and telephone number. Right. Get the f in my car. Doing? Get away from me. I, I, I ain't none of these silly goofy either. I asked you to move my car. I asked you to move your car nicely. Now move it. Then move. So get, get, get going. Your, go in your house. Like what you scared? No, of? I don't need to go in my house. Yeah, I don't need to move. Cause well, what you standing by my car for? I can't get in the car. You standing this well, close to my oh car. Oh well. Yes. I'm try I delivered your food, and she talked about something to move my car because, because you're in front right of my driveway. She called the police on me. She came out yes, of there. Yes, I'm ready to my car. I don't appreciate that. I can't see because she's blocking it. Like, all right, I believe it's delivery. a Volkswagen. She's like, blocking her driveway. She's not even getting in her car. She's, she's one of those crazy neighbors. Go in your house. It's a Volkswagen. It's a black Volkswagen. Because she's blocking my driveway. Go in your house. And look how you talking to people. It doesn't matter where I'm going. That's to see how she's talking. Go in your house. I am separated. I'm up on my lawn. She's on the street. That's insane. It's a stupid. And I'm on the street. I ain't pulling her driveway. I'm on the street. This, 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 this is a public street. Okay. You raising people's time. All right. I'm not arguing with her. It's the stupid lady next door. You are arguing. I'm not talking to you. I don't I'm care. You talking about statue. me? You see talking about was? me? What with you? Talk about see how you? You just called her her name five times. Ask her to see how you is. I think you need a mental check. That's what I think. You need to go ahead and call her yes, for yourself. You got a problem with people. Woman is pissed at her neighbor for showing up at her door. What are you, what, what, what can I help you with, ma'am? You're at my door. Can you leave my house? Can you please leave my house? Can you please leave? I'm asking you to leave. I do not feel safe. Why are you here? I want to talk to you. What would you like to talk to me about? Well, then please leave, ma'am. We don't have anything to talk about. Could you please leave my home? Why do you insist on harassing me? What do you want? Mama, I'm the stop, mama. mama. What do you want? Mama, mama, calm down. What do you mama, want with my child? Me. Mama, no. stop. What do you want with my child? Because you ain't got nothing to talk to her about. What do you want? I want to talk to you. No. I don't want to talk to you, ma'am. Would you please come? No, I won't. I'm asking you to please step back so that I can close my screen door. Please. You are at my home right now. You are at a place that I am paying to live at right now. You, you don't have any authority. You don't have any right to be here right now. Are you crazy? Mom, call the police. Mama, call the police. Call the police. Please leave. Ma'am, can you move? Because I don't want to touch you. I want to close my screen door. Cell phone break. The lady's right here. The audacity. The audacity. The audacity. Do you think she found that drive shaft? No. Somebody buried a drive shaft in here. A what? Yeah. Um, they stole my friend's truck, and I work for the police department. You cannot go and get a truck out of tow unless you have uh, the title, a license, a proof of ownership. Right. And supposedly her sister-in-law went and picked it up today. And they took the drive shaft out of it, and it was uh, found broken down on the East Texas Freeway. Mm -hmm. So I found all the components. You know, where they took the switches out and they took the steering column off. And it was going to be a screwdriver, screwdriver type thing. And um, she said, I'm missing the drive shaft. So I'm like, I looked through that ditch, you know, like a crazy person. So here I am. Okay. Just checking on you. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just trying to see. Your, na your name wouldn't happen to be Brenda. I don't know what the drive shaft looks like. Is your name Brenda Greer? No, it's Donna. Oh. From Montgomery County. Oh, okay. Right in Hayden. Yeah. What is it? Do you know what a drive shaft looks like? No. I mean, for all I know, that could be a drive shaft. So I, I started looking to see if these were little wires and they're little plants. Yeah. So I really don't know what I'm looking for. All right. I was just checking on you. All right. What's your name? My name's Chris. All right, Chris. Thank you. Upset man yells outside Toronto Mall asking why they closed the door. Why are closed? Tell us why you're closed. Thank you. 
We want to shop. We want to get into the Eaton Center. It is a public place. It says it's open till 7 o'clock. Why are you closed? Why? Why? Tell us why. Doesn't anyone else care? It's just a spectacle to you. It's just a spectacle to you. It's just funny. <laughs> I don't mind because it's the cops and they're always right. Right? You want to go shopping? Mm. You don't give a sh Not really. Not really. Then why don't you go f the camera and stop. Stop film. I'm saying I'm not giving you permission to film me. All right? You're in a you don't have place. permission. Huh? But you're in a public No, place. no, it's closed. It's no, closed. This is actually a privately held... Uh, oh, really? Company. You're going to explain it to me? Well, tell me why they're closed. I don't know. Cadillac Fairview doesn't want you in. Oh, Cadillac Fairview doesn't want me in? That's why they closed the whole place? Well, apparently. Are you nuts? A woman has an outburst after she's asked to show her receipt for the three TVs that she purchased. I don't got to show y'all my receipt. Yeah. You guys in your hand. I don't got to show y'all my receipt. Yeah. Sir, you're not leaving just I, yet. I, it's bought. It's paid for. Why he came? Her policy, I won't. It ain't no policy that I got. It, there is no why, why my policy that I got to show her my receipt, and I don't want to show her my receipt. I don't have to show her my receipt. Then you will not take these items with you. Home. You, oh, yes, I will. Ma'am, all we got to do is show your receipt. That's all. But I don't want to. I don't yeah. want to. Then, unfortunately, you that's y'all job to go in there and verify. No, no, ma'am. And you got so you telling me right now that if I don't show this receipt, I can't take my TVs? Yes, ma'am. That's what you telling me that? Yes, ma'am. Okay. I want to hear her say it. So I have to show you my receipt. Or I can't. Yes, the reason why you have to show us that receipt is because of the high dollar items that you have, and they can't fit in the bag. Okay. Anything that can fit in so the bag. It's so it's y'all policy that it's a must that I show you my receipt. Like, so I, and I can't. And if I don't show y'all my receipt. I can't walk out the door with that. I can't walk out the this door without my stuff, without showing you my receipt. I am going to call them. Thank you. I am going to call them. Take them my receipt right now. I am going to call them. Because y'all got all these police officers around me. But they was already up about some TV. No, because they approached me. They approached me. Why? Because I can't buy three TVs. Need to go viral. Facts, big facts, cause I knew this was gonna happen. I told him that. What that say? I'm not here. I'm what that say? Why? I just wanna know why you feel like it's a racist thing because we actually don't see. This is embarrassing. This straight embarrassing. <laughs> Let's go. This woman calls the cops on a group of people for being too loud.
old woman blocks a customer from accessing items at an aisle with her big dog. Are you okay? Are you, are you okay? I need to get seasoning. You're in my room, ma'am. Right. Yeah, somebody call a manager because she's tripping. Come here. She's dead. She's blocked it Can you call a manager, please? Can you call a manager, please? I'm trying to get seasoning, but she's in my way. Doesn't matter. I need to get something. You're in my way. What are you doing? Doesn't matter. We are. Come on now. You're in my way. Excuse me. And you got dogs. Yeah, you got whole oh. dogs in here. <laughs> no, my question is, so you're not allowing because she came the wrong way to get seasoning? That's my question. Uh -uh. Did, did she work, do you work here? Uh -uh. Do you work here? Uh -uh. No, but that's my question. You, you're, you, so you went the wrong way to get seasoning? Service. No, service. No. Uh, I'm not talking about that. But she's trying to get seasoning and she won't move out of her way. That's what she's saying. So, excuse me, so if I take your, me. If I was to take your bag and throw it left, would you move? What's your dog? I do know the law. I do know the law. So can you move? Oh, nobody's but we're not talking about the dog. She's trying to get something. I'm trying to get something. She's in my She does drive a time. Thank you. I don't know. No, she's talking to her. Thank you. Drunk Karen is bothering young kids, claiming they can't afford to live in the same place she does. Oh, what? what are you talking Double about? We live here. Double I own that apartment. Double Y. You know, you know what's crazy? These apartments are for people who make. Yeah. We tried moving in here, but we made too much. That's crazy, isn't it? Oh. That's crazy, isn't it? Oh. That's crazy, isn't it? That's crazy, isn't I it? I paid for me and three other I don't give a f here. I don't give a f That hurt you. Hurt me. Hey, hey back up. I'm mean, back Riley, up. Riley, don't do don't it. Don't touch me. Riley, don't, don't do it. Don't touch me. Respect these children. Don't touch me. Stop. You better respect these Who children. To respect the children, they weren't even in the road. Don't come no, up on me like that. They're not. No, they, they were nowhere near in the road. road. I was going ten but miles an hour. If they chased after a ball or something. Obviously, I was looking. Would have killed them. Going ten miles an hour. You can't stop at ten miles an hour. Yes, you can. Yeah, after you hit them. No, you can slow on the brakes and they'll stop completely. Smack, smack me, please, please smack me, please. I'm going to be pissed. She's not going to touch you. Hey, if she touches you, she's I'm going off on you. She touches you. me. Oh, my God. Hey, get back. I'm telling you. Riley, Riley, don't do it. I'm telling you. Riley, get back. Do not touch you. Do not touch me. Do not touch me. I'm telling you. Riley, 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 Riley. Get your wife, dude. I'm not touching you. I'm not touching you. What happened? I'm not touching you. What happened? Karen is trying to start drama with her neighbor and pushing his buttons to make the guy flip. You, you remember they said that uh, they, they want to repair that road? You are such a You know they're going to do my steps next? The HOA already told me they're going to pay for my steps. You know that? Come on, you're afraid. What? What am I afraid of? I come on, take a woman. Are you talking about sex? Are you talking about? Are you talking about sexually, Connie? Is that what you're trying to do? Are you trying to seduce me? Are you trying to seduce me? No, I'm saying I'll fight you right now. Those, you're not using. Why would I want to seduce you? You have no, no sexual. I can't stand a man in flip flops. Okay, I can't stand a woman that can't move her face because she's had too many surgeries. I, you know what? How many surgeries have you had? I get Botox in my, my I can tell. Okay. That's why your face doesn't, doesn't move. It doesn't count for my face. I haven't done nothing done with my face. Yeah, you're a liar. Botox. In your Big lips. Deal. Your lips. Big deal, Andrew. In your eyes. You've had your eyes done. Your, your ex wife and your girlfriend had Stutter, hair. Stuttering again. Hair. Stuttering again. I have no hair extensions. Just because, just because your boyfriend went back to Florida. No, boy. Just because I, you. Just, come on. Come on. See if you can take me. Please stay out of my yard. No. This is my yard. Mm -hmm. Because you know what? I asked Doug how far my yard run, and my yard goes to that tree. That dead tree that you killed? No, he didn't kill it. You killed it. I killed it? I've already had. So come on. Come on. 
think you can take me? No, I just wouldn't want oh, to mess. Mr. Marine, I wouldn't on. want to mess up that pretty face of yours, Constance. No, come on, Andrew. Come on. Constance. Come on. Come on, come. Why are you so upset? Andrew. Why come can't on. we just be friends? No, come on. See if you can take me. No, well, I don't want to take you. See if you can take me. Well, I don't want to take you. I just want to be I'm friends with you. I'm 58 years old. You See look 80. See if you can take me, Mr. Marine. No, I'm fine. No, you can't. That's what, in front of your son, you can't. Oh my your God. Your father is hey. a Winnie, hey. Winnie, hey. Winnie Pooh, hey. Jack, little baby who, who threatens Stutter. women. Stutter. Stutter. He threatens Stutter. women, but he Stutter. can't take them. Stutter. Stutter. He can't take them. He just like he did your, your Jasmine. You remember like your, your son. Remember? Your, your, your father your, can't your, take don't, 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 women, you but he stutter. threatens them. You're, you remember he your husband? Your husband him. keeps inside because he threatens them. <laughs> no, I've got men. All the all Charles. All Charles is the only one, and he don't even want you anymore, does he? I got all kinds of men. Do you get them all the time? Yep. How's it going? Oh, Might yeah. want to take the little ones inside. The uh, crazies out today. No, you come up at six eighteen a.m. I saw that on camera. <laughs> Her her medication is off again. Medication's off. Constance. Constance, your medication's off. Her I have, I'm recording if you need. Yes, ma'am. She's already trying to fight me and seduce me. You lost your mind, Connie. Stand in my yard. If you put your hands on me, I will defend myself. You're, You're fine, buddy. You're such an Stand in my yard and keep your hands off me. You can't even prove that's your yard. What do you mean I can't and prove? I'm, I'm standing in my yard. You touch me. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. She just needs to stay in my yard. Did you hit me? If you guys need anything, if you guys need my number. Did you hit me? No. Yes, ma'am. I asked you to stay off my property and you try to take my phone from me. Constance, get your medication. Stop drinking. Woman freaks out at an airplane, claiming the flight attendant is being rude to passengers. That she's talking to you. She wasn't talking to you. And if you associate with that word, that's your problem, not ours. Gutty, gutty, gutty. I appreciate it. Are you there? Gutty, are you there? Gutty. It's my choice. I can I can record if I want to. I can. Yeah, it's my right. I can record. And you guys are supposed to treat people like that? Instead to call the gender by looking and we have a little child? Do the video, please. You, you're supposed to treat the client like that? Please, land down. Please. Do the video. Can we have a drink for the kids? This is not have to be that big of a deal. We'll serve the drink service as soon as we're here. You treat the people here yeah, and the client. In the way you're supposed to do. Be kind, be nice, that's the real way. Okay, new job. Woman claims she was being disrespected by one of the McDonald's employees, then throws a drink at her. To me, she's incredibly rude. My food wasn't even made, and then I get attitude from her when I say I want my money back. We were waiting on the chicken food. I wish she had no idea what the food even was. She's ah uh, ah uh, ah, uh, and then you slab. I'm gonna throw this at you. No. Shut your mouth. You're the. You are the rudest person. I have ever dealt with. Karen, with too much on her hands, decides to lecture both a mother and her daughter about the daughter's dress code. Man claims this postal worker is threatening him and refuses to serve him on top of that. You gonna do your job? You gonna refuse me for what? Yeah, refusing you because you are because what? Insulting me. Insulting you? What did yeah. I say to you? You are insulting me. What did I say to you? 
do your job. I'm telling you. I asked you to please scan. You're, and then you started no, complaining saying, about please. me scratching your no, desk. You're, you're saying please. Okay. Okay? Okay. Be a nice person. I will be time. nice. Thank you. Okay? I know your name is Reza. Okay? Yeah, and I, I know. know your address too. Okay, Don't. so what are you trying to say? I'm trying to say that be be careful. What is that a threat? Time. Be careful. Yeah, you, you know my name and my address and be careful? Yeah, be careful. Because I'm, why? I will call to police. Next oh, police. Time. Yes, I because what do I do? Call. Because you didn't serve me? No, I will serve you. I'm serving you. started you. going crazy? Bye. You have to be nice. This is Canada, okay? Yeah, I understand that. You can't threaten people and say, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah I know my name and address. Woman loses it and goes on a yelling spree at an airport demanding her stuff back. Oh well, another neighborhood argument where one is screaming at the top of her lungs at the other while accusing the screaming one of being rude to her That's mother. That's why you've got a restraining order. You're not even supposed to be here. You're full of sh I was sitting over there reading the book and you had no right to even speak to me. I am on this side of the fence, you Stay on know. your side. I don't have no restraining Yo, order. Yo, can you please stop no, calling my mom out. that? Why do you want to lie? Why do you want to lie? We took care of it. Are took you, care of what? You're ignorant to the law. Do you, you know that I have listened to you yell for three days straight? I've listened to you three for days. Years. Oh, to bullsh**. I don't I live God. here. Jump in my I face. Because oh, you I'm guys have that. been teasing yeah, my, my mom's dogs. You have been teasing yeah, my mom's no, dogs, spraying water on them. Please do. Please, please call the cops. I was sitting over here reading a book and she just starts screaming at me. I do not have a car. I don't drive. I don't even have a driver's license. Please call them. I was sitting over here reading a book. Don't do what? We didn't say you did anything. What did she say? I was standing here the whole time. Stop acting like an idiot. Uh, call cops now. A woman asked the social worker to never show up in front of her again or she'll report and make her pay a fine. I have two people. I was one of them. Yeah. Okay, so I don't recognize you. I'm not in your jurisdiction. Don't come here again. What do you mean by that? Don't come here again. <clears throat> okay. okay. I'm recording this. All right. Dana, you said it was? No, it's Kate. Kate, don't come here again. So the, the problem... There is no problem. The problem is that you are trying to trespass on my property. Don't I'm, come here I'm again. I'm actually in the hallway, so I'm not trying to trespass. You but. are coming here, and you are attempting to trespass here. Don't come here again. I'm attempting to schedule a time to meet. You are attempting to schedule. trespass, okay? To discuss a report There's before. nothing that we need to discuss. Where my port is is perfectly fine. Don't come here again. Stop calling and stop coming here. I'm giving you notice right now that if you call me or if you send me anything in the mail, you will be charged $25,000 every time you do it and you agree to pay by doing so. You are being given notice. So that, that's not you true. Are, but that is true. The issue is and I that. promise you that you will be charged. Okay, where is your corporate charter? I don't know what that is. You have to file a corporate charter in order to operate as an agency in the Commonwealth. Where is it? 
So I work for the Department of Children. I know who you work for. Where do you file your corporate charter? Okay, I, I don't know what that you means. You don't know what don't that means? So you're coming here, and you're that's coming... part of our policies and procedures. That's your policy. Yes. It has nothing to do with me, it okay? It has to do with your family. And it does, has nothing to do with my family, okay? My family has the right to be secure, okay? Mm -hmm. And our persons and property, and you are coming here to invade my privacy, okay? I'm telling you right now, and I've already given you notice, if you come here again, or if you call and you invade my privacy again, you will be charged $25,000 every time you do it. Do you understand? Okay, so are do you, you, do you, no, do you no, understand? I, I understand okay. what you're saying. Do you understand what I say? I understand is agree. agree don't come no, to my door again. Not. Yes, it most certainly is. Do not come to my door again. On behalf of your, do you have a card? I don't, no. You don't. Let let's, see? Yeah, let's, let's take a look at that. See my ID? Great. Okay, Catherine. What did you say your name was? What? But. Okay. Do not come to my home again. Okay, this is this is my property. Court ordered. Can I ask you a question? You cannot ask me anything. I don't answer questions. What I do is I tell you what's going to happen. Okay, so if you I come here again, that, I'm sorry that you have fears. I'm sorry that, that you have fears. To court like last time. I'm sorry that you have fears, okay? That's if that's if I even agree to go to I don't have to agree to go to court. I'm not saying I'd like to okay? avoid all that. I we are going to avoid it by you not coming here again because because here. you are tra you are trespassing on my property. Okay. Okay. But, all right, and all if right, you come here over. again, and that's the third time, three times is a charm money. If you come here again, you will be charged. If you call me, you will be charged. If you send anything in the mail to me using my name or a name that is in the likeness of my name, you and your agency will be charged, and I will put it against your corporate charter. Do you understand? Can I just confirm you can't that do you anything other. Can... You can't do anything other than leave. I'm just you need to leave. Okay. Karen goes bonkers after a man calls her out for parking in a handicapped spot at school. Kind of rude. Why don't you move? Instead of coming up and taking pictures of it. Is that not rude? You're lucky my husband ain't here. Yeah. Oh, yeah? yeah? If you had a child that needed that spot, it would be a different that's story. That's not handicapped, though, and that's why I moved way over so that the person in the no. handicapped... No. no parking and it has lines because a person with uh, a disabled person needs that area in order to load and yeah, unload. I don't really care. You might want to watch yourself. Okay. Stop taking pictures of me. I mean, is there a reason you have to take a picture because I was parked in a spot? All you have to do is ask me to no, move. No, yeah, the police will give you a ticket what if I take a picture. You, whatever, been there, so. done that. Why didn't you just say, hey, can you move? Because I shouldn't have to. But you're rude, and I shouldn't have to deal with jerks like you. I know, I'm rude. <laughs> yeah, we're at, a, we're at a children's school. Oh, well, tell this dude to leave me alone. Yes. No, you need to stop. So inappropriate. I want my kid out of this school right now. Oh, good. Yeah. Happy to have your kid go. Feel bad. I'll be sending the car. Oh, my Lord. Drunk Karen says she has a master's degree after getting called out by her neighbors for starting trouble all the time. Because you guys are always Did starting stuff. So. Okay? We're always okay. Okay, that's fine. Always. Okay, it's a, it's a random question. Always. Okay. We are always okay. But you are screaming okay. this morning on the balcony. You're screaming. You look like you're like going, hey, you look like you're like going in and out of it right now. Are you 100% here with me right now? Yeah. Yep. I'm here yep. with you, right here. Oh, I on, see you go. right there. Okay. I see you right there. Okay. I see your, I see your right there recording me. I see you. You look ridiculous. Come on, let's go. You're 50 oh, years old. She's not 50, dude. I'm, I'm not 50. 50. Okay. But, you but you guys understand, like, we're not trying to do anything to bother you guys. You're the same age as my kids. We are. We are. So why are you arguing with people that are the same age as your kids? Listen, 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 listen. I'm a professor at Sac State, dude. I have a PhD. I don't need to be dealing with shit like this. I have my master's. Okay? I don't need it either. I don't need it either. All right, then. Just control your girl. I... Talk like that. You don't have to control me. Control. I'm controlled. Okay, well, back up from well, our window. Right? This okay, is, this is, so back up. This is in our your space. House. This is our your space. house, and you're this really just in the window. Yeah. Look, there's a there's a screen. There's a screen. Now they're glass. 
And now there's glass. Why would they come? Your house stinks. Your house stinks. Your house stinks. Your breath stinks. It reeks. It's your breath stinks. In my home. Oh my God. Come on. My bathroom. Everything. Oh. Oh my God. Okay. Come on. A professor at Sac State, and this is what you're doing? Yeah. That's, this is on. what you're doing? Look what you're doing, Dad. Bruh. Like what? A car park operator refuses to let a woman pass, claiming her pass has expired, causing a massive traffic jam. Working, this lady has a membership to get out of here. Like, she actually has, does not have a valid membership. I know, she doesn't I know, have one at all. I know it's not valid, but, but I, I, I can't actually get hold of the I'm people. sorry, but if everybody else must pay for their car park, so should you. I know, but I pay the $88 per month. I pay the $88 yes, per month and, every and month. You don't do it to us. You can't, it's not one that we manage for well, you. Then what's the number that I actually ring? All the people who you pay your cars through and ask them to sort it out. Well, I have, you don't have one existing. I have rung that number and it's like um, disconnected. So it's either reverse yeah, we can't, the amount I, on street. We can't I reverse. Can't You've got like a hundred cars here. I'm sorry, but she must pay if everybody else she must don't pay. Open, so she the, open the gate and I'll pay for no, her. No, or you can pay for her if you want to exit. Yes. I will pay for her, but like I said, I've ran halfway up the hill. As I mentioned to her, this is her business, this is her pass. She must pay the amount on screen. If that is, if she's got a valid yep. pass and they just haven't updated it, she'll be refunded. Look, what I'll do is I'll pay for her, but I can't run back to my car because there's a big tra traffic jam because the lady doesn't have any money. Well, ask her, I'm sorry, miss, but you must sort out your parking. You don't yeah, have but a valid we, we all can't leave like without... one you might have had with us years ago, but you don't have one now. So, with the validation, can you, can you, can you be quiet for a second, please? I've can you be quiet for a second? I'm sorry, with the validation out each month, because is this card actually Okay, inspired? well, you're, that's not to us. You're not paying it to us. Okay, then who am I paying it to? I don't know. Check your bank statements or check the instructions that you receive. It says per card that comes out every month and I pay it to and it's not company. Not to and I've been, I've been I've working been. at Metron Circle for the last five years. I've even contacted the I'm not just some random person who hasn't um, paid their parking fees. You need to let me out it's and this gentleman should have to Hold pay on. One second. Excuse me. What's going on is she's trying to explain herself to you, right? So she can be a true... For the last maybe half an hour, this isn't the first time she's contacted us. Well, it's not my fault that she my gets out of here. the last week hasn't been valid. Please pay the amount on screen. I'm sorry, but if everybody else you you parked here all day, that's an all day fee. Can you just let her out and I'll pay, I'll tell you no, what my number plate I'm is? Sorry, we can't. So how are we all I'll supposed to get out? We're gonna just stay here. Yeah, but I the can't. The rules are clearly stated at the entry gate. I, I get it. Oh, what I'm trying to do, what, what I'm trying to do is pay for it. But you just, I can't get my car to you because there's about a hundred cars because you're not trying to. Well, I'm sorry, but you can need a credit card here at the gate to help her pay for her fee. Well, she must organise how she's going to pay for her car parking today. Yeah, but what I'm trying to say is I am going to pay for her, right, but the car is about 100 cars down. I've ran all the way up the hill because there's a massive traffic jam because you're not being a human being and working with us so we can I'm solve sorry, this problem. I'm sorry, the terms and conditions we have been a human being. The lost ticket, we haven't applied the lost ticket fee here. If, we, if, if someone is willing to pay the lost car. ticket fee, but what I'm trying to say is just so I don't get, like, I have to run all the way back to the car. Ah, I'll give you my number plate. Okay, please do so. There isn't anything I can do from my side. Yes, there is, because I work in the centre. So if you want a problem, well, I will I'm make a massive problem. Must pay for their parking. Yes, and I'm going to pay for a parking, but what I'm trying okay, to do... Okay, so well, we'll, wait, we'll wait for you. That's not a problem. Old guy hurls racial slurs in a fit of rage after being denied service for refusing to wear a mask. Hey, good Mexican... That work here. Yeah. You. Whatever you say. You. Yeah. This yeah. place. <laughs> you, Johnny's. Take our bye bye. bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Come on, you little. I'm not leaving. Call the police. 
I'll leave. Get out, bro. I'm not. Yes, up, man. Call the police. Yes, I'm not. Up. Serve me. I'm not. Serve me. You're not a I'm not leaving. What? I'm not leaving. Too bad for you. I am not leaving. Too bad for you, man. Too bad for you. I don't care. I'm gonna raise hell here for the rest of the night. You wanna just serve me and just give me my food? Let me leave. I don't care what you do. Well, I don't care what you do. I lived in this town my whole life. I'm not leaving. Go ahead. Dame el, el, dame el combo. Serve this man so the next guy. I ain't leaving. Dame el combo. I'm going to call the police because yeah, you ain't serving yeah, me. Yeah, I'm going to call them right, right now. Woman confronts a man who's too cocky to admit that he almost ran her off and drove away. At least you could stop the car. You just really ran me off the road. I'm shaking. I didn't Why see you. Why are you filming me? Yet you just nearly caused an accident. Oh, are we playing the filming game, are we? Yeah. What are you scared of? I'm not scared of you. God, that is ridiculous. If you cause, nearly cause an accident, you should pull over and say, are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, okay, yeah, sure. Yeah. Is that what you normally do? You can just you, drive off. Can you, you, we were this close to having a major crash. If it wasn't for my driving, we would have just had a crash and you would be paying to fix up a Range Rover. Oh, well, congratulations for driving a Range Rover. But that, that was just the most ridiculous piece of driving I've ever seen. Okay. What if my children had been in the car then? I don't know. I, I didn't see you there. What can okay, I Okay, so if you make a mistake, stop and see if the other person is what, okay. You, you don't on? just drive off. You what? don't do that. That's not correct. Do you want me to stop on Mogul Road? No, there was a place to stop at the top of the hill. You could have stopped there. You were clearly okay. I didn't hit you. Oh, mate, you are an absolute man refuses to pay the tow truck driver after illegally parking his car and jumps inside the truck. What do you want? Put it down. Okay, pay me. Uh, uh, why are you supposed to pay you? Because you have to pay, me. to pay me. Yo, yo, don't go with... Hey, I am not listen. Put get down. out of the truck before I throw you out the truck. Put it down. I'm giving you a warning right now. Get out Put it down. Get out the... Put it down. Get out I'm the truck. Coming. Now. I'm coming out. Put act down. like a f***ing human, okay? Don't act like I a Get away from my truck. Listen. Now. Get away from my truck. Get away from my truck. Don't do that again. Put it down. Okay? Please. Act civil. Put it down. Okay. Okay. I'm Fifty dollars, I put it down. Otherwise, I'm gonna take the me. Listen. Put it down. Okay. I give you twenty. Are you gonna come down? I'm not I'm not a crack. Twenty dollars that bad. Why are you rating me all Why Because you jump in my goddamn truck, okay? Why you want fifty dollars from me? To put your truck down. Listen, it's the going rate. Okay? Huh? It's the going rate. I know I know what you're upset. But he's reading people off. What? I'm not I ripping people off. Look at the damn signs minutes. everywhere. Two, and then you lie and you say you're inside the bank. Right. Why yeah, do I have to pay him fifty bucks? Listen, you don't have to pay me. I'll leave. No, I'm I not. I'm not. I suggest. I'm, uh, I suggest you pay. I, I suggest you pay or call the police. Give me fifty bucks. I need 50. I don't have 50. Okay, let me get the 100. No, give me your 50. Listen, I'm I'm not going to leave anywhere with your car. Let's do this the right way, okay? Okay, give me he 50 dollars. by the bank. He'll go get give me 50 dollars. Listen, I have 50 dollars. I'll give you. Get off my Unbelievable.